Welcome back in temperatures starting to fall overnight. We're in the 60s right now and it's going to be cool and crisp by daybreak. The kids might need the hoodie or the light jacket with a cool feel temperatures in the lower 50s. However, there's no worries of any frost with those temperatures well above the freezing mark. Looking ahead towards the afternoon, a balmy summer feel 83 degrees, a few fair weather clouds late in the day. Lots of blue in the sky, though it is going to be a gorgeous day with calm winds. But due to that direction out of the east southeast, it's going to be another one of those days where the lakeshore counties get the short end of the stick with some cooler temperatures. When you wake up, it's going to be in the 50s outside, so perhaps a couple layers. But by the afternoon, shorts and t-shirt weather, 83 in Toledo, Bowling Green over towards Henry and Fulton counties as well. And along the Indiana Ohio state line, well into the 80s in Williams and Defiance counties. Now in Port Clinton and Sandusky, you'll notice that orange color shows you the lake shadow due to that wind direction, meaning a cooler feel near Lake Erie shoreline. Looking at the Biggest week in American birding temperatures take flight to the 80s. It is going to be a mainly sunny, brilliant and beautiful day for birders from out of town. Friday is going to bring our next change in the weather as spring showers return. It's not going to be a washout. It is only a 60% chance and there is the chance for a couple thunder showers as well. No severe weather concerns for Friday. High pressure keeps sunshine in the mix for your Thursday. However, look at the bottom of your screen. These showers going to be rolling in from the southwest by daybreak Friday. There is the chance for rain, mainly southwest of Toledo. Areas like Putnam County going to see the rain first. By Friday afternoon, rain becomes a little more widespread and some of those pockets of orange show you isolated thunderstorms as well. Friday night to Saturday, keep the umbrella handy. It is going to be a damp start to your Saturday morning. Good news for Saturday afternoon though, this cluster of showers, it's going to push into the central part of the state and that means by Saturday afternoon, we should be nice and dry with a few peaks of sunshine. Mother's Day weekend, a mainly dry Saturday, only a 20% rain chance, no need to cancel plans and the rain chance does up to 40% for mom. However, I still think you will be able to squeak in some outdoor time with only a few showers and perhaps an isolated rumble of thunder. Weekend rain chances fairly sparse, 20% Saturday, 40% Sunday. Next week starts off with sunshine and 70s and overall a mild and bright week of weather ahead.